Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. Well, it is a great view inside Wembley. It gives it that special feeling no matter which match it is hosting. And we rise now for the Spanish national anthem. Well, they have thrown down the gauntlet with that anthem. Now to match it. high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction, and hopefully the style of contest. There's the whistle, and here we go. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular? Ferran Torres! Jorginho. Marco Verratti. And here's Immobile. Now it's Insigne. And he's cut it out. Gets it upfield. Verratti loses his balance and loses the ball. Panucci. Chiesa plays it long. And he's managed to get himself offside. And here's Morata. Morata really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. And here's Morata. Ferran Torres can't get the better of his opposite number. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Well played, he saw that coming. Chooses to go back. Koke. Gets the better of his man. Has a goal! And for a moment, time stood still. That's just front foot enforcement. Pressure leads to mistake, leads to chance. Chiesa. Gaia. No question, that's a foul. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is.
Kaya. And it's Pablo Sarabia. Jorginho. That's a decent ball. Chiesa. Oh, it's a fine challenge and it goes his way. Plays it back. He's gone for it! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Morata. Bonucci gets it back. Chiesa. And the shot! This could fall anywhere. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Goes for goal! Goal! Well, that's a start. And what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something, given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Doubt very much that this was in the script. Gaia. And it's Pablo Sarabia. Italy are already ahead. The perfect start. Well, they've managed to get their noses in front early because they've been much quicker out of the stalls. They've set out high tempo and intensity. And look as though they, they want it much more at the moment. It's Morata! Keeper's done ever so well. Morata sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. And it's played forward. Tried to play it through. Uh, it was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. And here's Pablo Sarabia. Could be thinking about shapes to shoot. Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Okay, with the short one. Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. Okay, has overhit that horribly. Hoists it forward. Marco Verratti. Italy out in front with an early advantage. Immobile goes looking. Spain are working the ball as only they can. Yeah, Peter, and it's a style that requires players of high-caliber technique to move the ball about quickly in tight areas. He's got through. Well positioned to make that interception. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Italy seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was easily read and dealt with. Tries to get it forward quickly. Raspinaqueta, hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Jose Gaia cuts it out. Raspinaqueta. 
Ferran Torres. Ferran Torres conjuring up some magic on the right-hand side. Tries to get it clear. Jorginho. And here's Pablo Sarabia. Oh, and the shot! Jorginho. Now it's Immobile. And it's Insigne. It's a good run down the left-hand side. A buccaneering run from the defender. Insigne. Now it's Immobile. He gets past his man. Shoots! He scores! Two up and threatening to pull clear. What about that, Jim Beglin? Well, the penalty box usually is the place where you get least time on the ball, and yet they were able to exchange passes before an unchecked finish. And I mean, to be honest with you, that should open up an inquest. Italy grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Chiesa. Forward it goes. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. They have them in their sights again. Oh, that is a bit special. This is threatening to become a really good game. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. That's gone a long way up and away. Pablo Sarabia. Chiesa. And it's got through. Chiesa. Has a pop! Jose Gaia can hoist it clear. OK, drives it forward. Chiesa pings it out wide. Hits one! Another chance! No mistake! That's no fluke, it's what he was there for. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. The crowd are calling for this to be put to bed. There's little sympathy about. With a delicate ball, cut out in the nick of time. Ferran Torres. Big chance! And yes, it's there!
A moment that needed composure, and he had plenty of it. I just thought he knew exactly what he was doing by feigning to move one way and then readjusting back. Controlled trickery. We have got ourselves a game here. I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Tries to get it forward quickly. Chip through. And he's there to clear it. And it's played forward. And that is as far as they're going to go. It's Morata. That's clear cut. It's a free kick. Immobile. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. Keeper's got good distance on that. Well, to step in there, that was more than necessary. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Forward it goes. Going through. Room for a shot. And the finish! You've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very slim. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they paid the price and deserved to. He's made it three, quite a day at the office for him. Oh, this has been an immense contribution from one player. He's been just about unplayable. The irresistible force today. Italy take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Well, that goal should be a big game-changer. It's certainly been a big mood-changer. Looks to clip it forward. Marco Verratti. Done very well to intervene. Koke. Okay. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. And it's Koke. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Right through the middle. As Piliqueta gets rid without sophistication. Ferrati. Ferrati! A real chance and a real let-off. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. It's gone for a throw-in. Jorginho. And it's Ferrati. Ferran Torres. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Emerson battles to win it back. He's got away. And it's Immobile. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Little doubt, that is a foul. He gets a ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Away from immediate danger. Bonucci. Ferran Torres. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. 
Benucci is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression before the ref does it for him, Peter. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. As Pliqueta made a definite foul there. There to make a great save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. It's come loose. Spain being made to look sloppy in possession here. That's a throw. Gets wrestled off the ball. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Can he? Has a pop! They've done it! Half time imminent! What a time to score! get themselves back into contention. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. Jorginho. Chiesa. What a throw in. And it's Jorginho. He's had a shot! And tested the keeper. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Ferran Torres. Sports official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. As Pliqueta plays it over to the other flank. Hoists it high. Oh, good interception. Hoists it forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Forward it goes. Now it's Insignia. He's going after it, and he's going long. Clears it out of harm's way. Whistle goes for half time. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's Spain have a free kick. Immobile with good energy in defence as well. You have to admire a commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Gaia. Pablo Sarabia. Finds himself eased off the ball. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Jorginho plays it forward. Chiesa.
Ferran Torres tries to get it forward quickly. It's got through to him. Morata goes for the cross. Spain making a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front, and this is something different. Hoists it forward. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Ferran Torres. Ferran Torres. Can he hit one? It's there. The second half off to a spectacular start. And it has to be said, an absolute gift. We have ourselves a real game here. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well-matched, and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. Gaia. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Insigne displaying his defensive capabilities there. That's no striker's tackle. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line in that defence, and, and he's delivering. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? And it's played forward. Ferran Torres just brushed off the ball there. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. And that's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Ferran Torres, Spain disappointing in the end there. No lack of urgency. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Immobile. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Now it's Insigne. Gets away from his opponent. That's the end of that. It all started well enough. Emerson goes looking. He's looked long this time. Well, goals change games, and now that parity has been restored early in this half too, this game could take off in a direction they weren't expecting, and the next phase of play requires a stronger rear guard action from them there. Gaia. Forward it goes. Pablo Sarabia. It's a loose ball. Oh, real chip has a hit! <laughs> he played it short. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw, some real no-nonsense defending.
Chiesa tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Morata. Morata showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. He's left his man. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Chiesa. It's a brilliant interception. Immobile. It's Immobile! Gaia. Koke. What looks like he's in need of protection here. Well, it's about time, isn't it? Only after he's uh, just notched a third. Insigne plays a clever pass. And they've been caught out here. He's gone for it! <laughs> Goal, Italy! And they're back in front. Well, how's that for a class finish? Ah, that's just clever. He made the keeper think he was going one way, only to outfox him by going the other. Very nice. Four in the game. He is the man. Italy get themselves into the lead. Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering, and listen, we all expect that. Now it's Immobile. Chiesa. Immobile. And here's Immobile. Jorginho can't get the better of his opposite number. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Yeah, uh, he may feign to shoot and just play it into the box. Fair attempt, just the wrong outcome. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Koke. Raspilicueta. Played out to the right. Koke drives it forward. Just brushed off the ball there. Now it's Immobile. Nicely measured pass. Morata! And in it goes! Once more they've done it! They just will not lie down! Ah, oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. This has become one superb game of football. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Has he found his man? Emerson. And it's Immobile. What an adventurous run from a defender. And you can get that clear.
Gets the better of his man. Immobile. He's played him through. Now it's Insigne. Going for goal! Goal, Italy! Into the lead once more. A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Immobile is the obvious danger man here, and yet he has afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. How many more does he want? Italy go into the lead. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. Ferran Torres. Okay. Almost 75 minutes on the clock now. Koke. Lovely bit of skill. Insigne did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Ferran Torres. Emerson gets it back. Hoists it forward. Now it's Insigne. Immobile. Immobile has got himself a free kick. And this is the perfect opportunity to create a cushion between the sides. Insigne! Shakes the shoot. That would have won it. Oh, and a real chance to pile on the pressure, and he'll be desperate to get another. Keeper sends it forward. And it's Pelotti. Pelotti. It's Pelotti! Oh, should have put that away. Okay. Spain going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Gets it back. Gaia. Pablo Sarabia. That's surely a foul free kick. <laughs> Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And there's a long ball. It's out for a goal kick. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. He's had a shot, and the follow-up, it's come back out. He has done it. Well, this is a terrific show of resilience and spirit. I love to see a team roll up their sleeves and force their way back. Superb. Donnarumma did well the first time. Nothing he could do about the follow-up. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. Well, it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction.
we have ourselves a real game here. Well, there's resilience for you, Peter. As a side, they never lost focus despite the setback. Bellotti! Goal, Italy! And again they hit the front. The purest possible contact. What a fabulous strike. Yeah, I just thought he made great use of his upper body there. It would have taken something really special to keep that out. Italy take the lead. I think the danger for them now is fatigue. I think when the body tires, the mind soon follows. So concentration is key from here. Gets wrestled off the ball. Berardi. Italy are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end too. And here's Morata. This is gone, that's a foul. He's got it's Morata! Spain are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Belotti. Berardi receives it in a good position. Italy probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. Spain get it back again. And it's Pelotti. Now it's Insigne. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Bellotti tries to stroke it through. Lorenzo tries a shot! Italy can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock. Berardi! Really well taken goal. An act of charity gratefully received. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Yeah, looks very much like the final nail in the coffin for me, I have to say. Emerson. Bellotti. Out to the right. He gets past his man. It's anyone's ball. Jorginho. And here's Berardi. Pellegrini has it out wide and in space. Has gone out. And it's played forward. Koke. Into a minimum of four minutes additional time. That's Pinaquetta. Too much on that, it's gone out. And it's Insigne. Bellotti. Berardi provides an outlet. Lovely feet. Berardi opts to play it back. Sprayed out wide. 
Gorgeous control there. Berardi. Oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. Berardi gets it out to the wing. Good challenge. He just stood firm. And here's the chance to counter. Out to the left it goes. Berardi. So that's it. It is all over. A decent win by a very competent performance. Without doubt they were the better side. And the result reflects as much. Your final thoughts, Jim?